The U.S. Postal Service is looking into several mailboxes that were pried open throughout Course Gold. People say they're concerned that the community had another string of mail thefts in October of last year. Action News North Valley reporter Natalie Granda joins us live from Course Gold with more on the theft and tips from, for preventing this from happening to you. Natalie. That's right, Graciela and Margo. 11 parcel lockers were pried open over the weekend, and even some PO boxes at the USPS facility were also broken into. Luckily, post office employees say that there was nothing in them. Now, people here in Course Gold say that they've been seeing this happening more often, and what they want to see now is a solution. It's been going on for quite a while, but not to the extent it is now. Um, in the last, I don't know, six months or a year, it's just gotten so much worse. People in Course Gold say it's happening more often, and over the weekend, it happened again. Postal investigators are looking into almost a dozen parcel lockers that were broken into on Saturday. Jenna Singleton says she's fed up and wants to see this stop. It is very concerning. I mean, it's, it's, it's not the first time it's happened um, to me. I had my identity stolen once. New parcel lockers were installed on Tuesday afternoon, replacing the ones that were pried open. Some had notes telling people to pick up their mail at the post office because their mailboxes were still easily accessible from the back. They're, they're locked. The, the issue with them is if someone is to, to break into the back side of them, you know, they have access to every box in that uh, pod or in that cluster. Madeira County Sheriff's deputies were dealing with another string of coarse gold mail break ins late last year. When they see situations like this, happen, they step up patrols. We typically do try to, to move resources over that way to try to have more patrol checks, you know, so a deputy's going by those areas more often. Residents like Dave Fernandez say because of the break-ins, they prefer to just pick up their mail at the post office. It's an inconvenience to come here, but at least you know your stuff is safe. So far, no one's been found responsible for the break-ins, but deputies ask that if anyone knows anything to call the sheriff's office. Now, of course, there's a lot of concerns with getting your mail stolen, identity theft being one of them. So deputies recommend not leaving anything in your mailbox overnight and that if you see anything suspicious, to call it in. Live in Madera County, I'm Natalie Granda, ABC 30 Action News.